guys, so the other day I was watching the most worn tag that Miss Glamorazzi or Ingrid just filmed. And I thought that it was a really cool idea, so I figured that I would film it with my favorite um, products that I have been using and loving this summer. So the first category is your favorite nail polish, and my favorite nail polish has been this one. It is Lucky Lucky Lavender by OPI, and it is a pinky purpley pastel, and I've just been loving it this summer because Number one, it's the perfect pastel for the summer. And number two, it looks awesome with the tan. Um, it's the perfect mix of pink and purple, and I just think it's so pretty. The second category is your favorite hair product. And instead of picking like a leave-in conditioner or a scrunching spray, I decided to pick a hair tool because I feel like I've been using this the most this summer. And the tool that I picked is my uh, one and a half inch hot tools curling iron. I just love this because I feel like Naturally, I have pretty coarse and a little bit, it's wavy and frizzy hair, and when I put heat on it, it really tames it and just makes it lie really nicely. When I curl it with this, it just gives me really nice, big, loose waves, and obviously, depending on how long I hold it for, um, sometimes they're tighter, sometimes they're looser, but this um, curling iron is just, it's awesome. It gets the job done. I love curling my hair because... Obviously you go out with it curled, but if it falls, it just sort of falls to like a kind of straightened. Wearing it curled is just an easy way to kind of assure that no matter really what happens to your hair, it won't be frizzy, it won't be puffy, um, because the curls usually hold your hair in pretty well. So I've really been liking that this summer, and I think it's a really good way to kind of do your hair and look very nicely put together, but also it doesn't take that long and it's easy to do. So um, I've really been loving that. Category number three is your favorite bag. And my favorite bag, it's on the floor here. My favorite bag has been this bag by Betsy Johnson. It's a big, pink, uh, soft leather bag. And I love it because it's really, really big. And, oh, it has really cute inside lining, too. It's really big, and the color is really awesome for summer, obviously. It's this really pretty pink pastel. Um, but it, I really like it because it's really big, and you can fit a lot of stuff in it. I can carry my book in it. If I'm going to the movies, I bring a sweater in case I get cold. So it's just really nice because I can put a lot in it without it being bulky. It's more so just filling it. So category number four is your favorite shoes. And my favorite shoes this summer have been these flip-flops by Report. And I really like them because they are obviously, they're just flip-flops, which wearing flip-flops in the summer is the easiest thing you can do. But they're kind of a fancier twist on like the average Old Navy flip-flop. Um, so they really look nice when you're like wearing a dress, but you don't want to look too dressy. They're perfect, but you can also wear them with shorts and they just dress up an outfit a little bit, but don't look too fancy. So they've just been really nice shoes um, for this summer and I love them. And since they have both black and brown, they really go with anything. So these are great flip-flops and they're super comfy. Category number five is your favorite accessory. So... I obviously wanted to do my favorite sunglasses because what is summer without sunglasses? So my favorite sunglasses are my Kate Spades and they look like this. They are little cat eyes and I love these. Um, I love brown sunglasses. I'm not really quite sure why I prefer brown over black but I love them and these are just little brown tortoise shell. I love the shape and also I love big sunglasses. I just think that they're more flattering especially on my face. So I've been loving these and I think they're so cute. <laughs> and also, um, to go with accessories, I wanted to pick a jewelry item too because I thought sunglasses were a no-brainer, but jewelry is a no-brainer too. So my favorite jewelry item, which you probably have seen in this video when I've lifted my arm, is this bangle that I wear on my arm. I just think it's really cute and just adds like a little bit of like bling or shimmer or glitter or whatever you want to call it to any outfit. <laughs> um, but I just love that. I don't know. I just feel like more girly and my outfit's more complete when I put on my bangle. So I always do that. Category number six is your favorite clothing item. And for this, I chose bandeau tops. So as you can see, I have a variety. And I just love these because, first of all, I think the lace is super cute. These ones are from Free People. But I love these because they're a really easy way to kind of tie together any outfit. So if your shirt's low cut, if your shirt's cut down low on the sides, it just adds a cute touch. And I think that they go with almost everything. And there's so many different colors out there and designs. And I just think they're so cute and can be worn so many different ways. So I feel like they're a very versatile and intelligent item to have for the summer. Category number seven is your favorite foundation. And I do still wear foundation sometimes when I'm going out at night for like a date in the summer, but during the day or just on a casual night, I choose to wear something lighter. And what I've been going for every time is this Stila Beauty Balm. And this is awesome. It is 
tinted a little bit, so it kind of acts as a very, very, very light foundation. It masks any redness or any discoloration that you might have, but it put, it's very light and it doesn't really feel like there's anything on your skin. And if you're worried about the tinted color of this, um, the color in this actually blends out to most skin tones. My cousin was visiting, I told her to try this out because I love it. And she has she had a lighter complexion than I do at the time and it blended into her skin the same way. It just gives this very flawless, um, natural skin look. So it looks like your skin but better. And it's a really good canvas for anything. So if you put concealer and a little bit of powder, it makes you have really flawless skin. It's, it's just a really good product. Number eight is blush or bronzer, and I chose um, bronzer because I've been using bronzer a lot more than blush this summer. And the bronzer I chose is NARS Laguna. No one's probably really surprised by that because I feel like everyone loves it. Um, this is just the best color bronzer. It's not too bronze. It's not too orange. It's blendable. It's just awesome. I love it, and I swear by it. And you get so much with it. Like, I have not, I've had this for a couple months and I haven't even hit pan at all and I wear it every day. Category number nine is a lip product and for me this was a no-brainer. Some of the other categories were a little bit tougher um, to pick just one product because I am kind of a multi-product girl but this one was a no-brainer and it is my uh, YSL Volupt Sheer Candy Lipstick Lip Balm. I'm not really sure what it is because it doesn't have the consistency of a lipstick at all but it it might be considered one. It's this gorgeous um, hot pink. You can't really see it. My lighting's really bad. I'm sorry. I'm just sitting by a window. But it is, I'll put it on for you. It is the prettiest hot pink. It has the nicest consistency. It is so soft and so moisturizing. It's just an awesome product and it's beautiful. Category number 10 is your favorite mascara. And for this, I chose... Lash Blast Fusion, and I'm not usually the type of girl that sticks to one mascara. I have a bunch. I have some high-end, some drugstore, um, but I've really been liking this one for the summer in particular because it's not waterproof. I don't like waterproof um, mascaras. I find them really hard to get off and sometimes flakier than regular mascara, but um, this one's water resistant, so I can wear it all day, and it won't smudge when I'm like in the heat, but I can get it off easily at night. The Lash Blast mascaras have a really nice wand. It's super thick and I personally like really thick and full lashes. So this is really a good mascara. And the final category is number 11, eyeshadow. Um, for my favorite eyeshadow, I chose a Paint Pot by MAC and I chose Painterly. It's just a nude, very skin tone esque color. Um, and I love this because this color is really my skin tone, but just like better. Um, it's a little bit pinkier than what I am, but it's perfect for um, my skin tone. So when I put this over my eyes, it just makes them, just gets rid of any like discoloration and just makes my skin look even more flawless as a whole and kind of makes my eyes look a little bit more green and just, it just makes them look better. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I tag all of you to film this video too. It was a lot of fun and I was really excited to film it so um, I encourage everybody to. So make sure that you like the video if you enjoyed watching it and make sure you also subscribe to my channel if you want to see more from me. So thank you for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Bye!